And welcome back to Talk of the Town. And Kim, well, explain to me why I feel like I'm the token guy on The View. Well, because today you are. <laughs> the hometown of Lockport is getting ready to enjoy what is fast becoming one of the largest food festivals in Western New York. Join us now from Jenny Marketing Group of New Fane is the coordinator of the Taste of Lockport, Lockport, <laughs> Jennifer Serrano. And we have a few other guests with us as well. We have Holly Balk from Steak, Stone and Sushi. Also, we have Carolyn Unitas Ruse from the Buffalo Dolls, and uh, Holly and Carolyn will be all over during the Taste of Lockport. And yes, you are the, token, the token gentleman. <laughs> and aren't you lucky? I'll just uh, take care of this food while you guys talk. Right? Oh, good luck. Okay. There's more of us than you, and we're going to have that food. But first, <laughs> hello. Thank you so much for being here, Jennifer. Thank you for having me. And of course, Jennifer is, you know, um, so much of the Taste of Lockport, we have Jennifer to thank for. Actually, you have the Lockport Business Association, but I thank them for giving me the opportunity. <laughs> and how many years has the Taste of Lockport? This is the 15th year for it. So 15 years later, I think you guys really know what you're doing. Well, I would hope so. I would hope so. <laughs> and how many restaurants? We have 23 today, or this year. 23 And I say today because we are still taking participants applications. So it's not too late to, oh. to, to, to too late. Oh. Okay, Did you hear up. that, Lockport? You can still sign up and be a part. Just get a hold of Jennifer here because the more the merrier, right? Absolutely. How we many people do you expect to? attend this year? This year we're hoping to, we, typically we have 7,500 throughout a six-hour day. Mm -hmm. We've extended the hours and it's very celebratory, so we're, we're hoping for close to 10,000. And you're, you're doing some new things this year. I was reading up on your website that, uh, of course, it's a very family-friendly event. Absolutely. And uh, more than just the food, you've got some uh, activities going on. We have a huge kids zone um, featuring Western New York entertainment pros, and they are going to have five bounce houses, an obstacle course, pony rides, petting zoo, you name it. <laughs> That's great. So you really are encouraging the families to come out with their kids and, and to taste the food, but to also enjoy just their community. That's right. The Lockport community. And you're going to have vendors this year. Yes. More than just food, but vendors. And um, there's a, I, I heard, Phil, I heard there's a world record someone's trying to break in Lockport. And it doesn't have to do with eating food. Oh. Uh, oh. <laughs> no, actually it is because it's the 150th sesquicentennial celebration in the city of Lockport. And since the taste is the final event, we decided we should celebrate that with a world record. And what, what world record are you trying to hold? We are going to have 7,000 people singing over a live broadcast on Jack FM, the Erie Canal song. The old Erie Canal song, we all know it. <laughs> the old Erie Canal song. Okay, we all learned it. In we, all, we all know it, and and luckily we have Carolyn here. The old Erie Canal song, Carolyn. I'm putting you on the spot. You are putting me on the spot. <laughs> How's it go? How's it go, Carolyn? Oh, come on, everybody. Um, I've got a mule, and his name is. Sal. Sal. <laughs> 15 miles on the Erie Canal. All right, it's a good thing Carolyn was here because otherwise we were going to make You wouldn't want me to sing it, right? And that yes, just yes. Only on that day, though. Yeah. You are going to come down and right, right. be a record breaker. Out of the 7,000. Okay, just as long as you can't hear me sing Oh, it. so low. How low? <laughs> and then um, we've got some tasty treats here. Holly mm. from uh, Steak, Stone, and Sushi. Yes. Tell us what we're looking at. Well, right here you have, um, we have some great appetizers. This is our amazing Kale which is uh, lately battered squid. Uh, we do Am get I it in allowed? fresh. You Am are more I than allowed? welcome to. Um, mm. This is your dipping sauce right here. Yes, which is a, It's like a sweet chili sauce, kind of. Mm. It is mm. very good. Mm, it's so good. So you guys will be at the Taste of Lockport, right? Yes, we will. Sushi. It'll be our second year attending. We were there last year. Um, we featured our rock shrimp last year, which was good. We did get the best appetizer, but we wanted to do something different this you year. You won the best appetizer? We Congratulations. did. Congratulations. Thank you. Um, another appetizer we have is coconut shrimp, which I'm sure you've had at many other places, but it, ours is... Yours is better. Oh, it's exquisite. Um, if you want to try that as well. One, sh sh somebody. Twist my arm. <laughs> Twist my try it. Sure. I'll, I'll, yes. I'll just so while I'm while I'm um, eating the uh, coconut shrimp because I'm going to eat the coconut shrimp now, uh, when will the Buffalo Dolls be performing? We will be the performing at uh, 4:30 in the evening until 7 o'clock. Will be the closing act, I believe. Um, we sing hits from the 1920s to the 1960s. We also have some Erie Canal and old time tunes that we've sung in Lockport before. Uh, there are three of us in the group. We're all music teachers, and we love 
singing this and style music. You guys have music. a lot of fun. We do. We do a lot of Andrew Sisters style harmonies. We have a blast. It's, it's so it's great. like a big We've party. Been... Food, friends, music, and coconut this, uh, shrimp. And this party has a <laughs> kind of a nautical theme too. Yes, uh, from our roots, the Erie Canal. We're celebrating everything nautical. Come uh, wearing your sailor hats and. <laughs> I, I heard rumors that there would even be mermaids. Uh, I don't know. We could have some. <laughs> could have some. <laughs> Some mermaids on the Erie Canal. <laughs> what a not, yeah, nautical uh, idea, okay. <laughs> and um, so let's see, it's your 15th anniversary, live music, family activities. Plenty of food. Over 7,000 people. World record. Man, it's going to be great, ladies. So um, I know we have a few minutes left. Did we leave anything out? Jennifer, did we leave anything no, out? No, I can't think of anything you left out except that whoever can bring the most people to and register to be part of our record-breaking attempt will win a contest for their group, a party for all of them. So get your people together and try to have the most people. Okay. You can register at the event and we'll have pre-registration at cruise night in Lockport. So that's, that's for the record-breaking event. That's for the record-breaking. When, when you go singing. to break a record, a world record, how do you confirm that? Uh, we're actually having a judge come into town to announce it right there. So okay. it's on the up and up. So it's he, on the up he goes and up. along and he he counts seven thousand <laughs> heads. To the One. <laughs> I believe Two. it. I believe it's broken down into groups <laughs> just to make it a little easier. But um, we will have an auditing firm that'll confirm the results, and we have stewards of each group that will confirm that their group was actually singing. And from that, <laughs> you have to sing if you not go, just, Phil. Not just That's right. Sing early, right? From that, they'll determine that we've broken the record. That's excellent. That's awesome. So the largest group, the largest group, Western New York, you get a party. The largest group to go and sing wins a party. Yes. And what does that party entail? Oh, food and fun. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, one last question now. Uh, in your experience, all the food, all the fun, what's the most unusual dish that you can, that in your experience, has been at the Taste of Lockport. Is there anything? Well, I must say, this is my first year as the event organizer, mm -hmm. but I do, I'm privy to all of the food selections that are coming in, and there's one particular one that has piqued my curiosity and I'm gonna stop and have. It is Big Boss Man Tony's Peanut Butter and Jelly Chicken Wing. <laughs> what? <laughs> Peanut Butter and Jelly Chicken Wings. Kind of interesting. Okay, so that's, that's a twist on the buffalo around there. chicken wing. <laughs> well, you know, I'm thinking it's going to have a nutty, kind mm -hmm. of tangy flavor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what, <clears throat> Phil? We're about to go to break, and um, while we go to break, I don't know about the rest of you, but <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to eat my way through break. Thank you so much, ladies, for being here. You're very welcome. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you, Holly. Thank you, Carolyn. And Western New York, see you at the Taste of Lockport.